this is pretty much where I have left off because I was telling you about um, give me a minute I had to cover that speaker I was going to get back to you guys about this uh, tractor boat um, taking the engine out so I took the Vanguard out and it's sitting inside so that'll be rebuilt someday alrighty then so I gotta clean it up a little bit and I uh, changed the pulley on it I'll show you it's that one the thing was seized and since I changed it I got the brakes working that's a bonus because brakes didn't work I'll show you this thing I'm um, sorry didn't have the camera angled on it the silver thing here should turn not, a, not at all you know what I mean and that's what's on it sitting like that and then that's underneath it So, see how I did a see how I did the fuel line. Just left it like that because I don't know what else to do with it for now. Hope the 16 will work in it. This is the last chance. Oh, a lot of you guys are probably wondering what happened to the truck. I uh, scrapped it unfortunately, but. I had taken my money, or taken my money, sorry, I don't have very good grammar skills. I came from a school out in the country, you, give me a break, you know, but anyways, um, I bought a tattoo kit, a professional tattoo kit, it was a cheap one, just so I can get started, and uh, I'm going to tell you guys about that right now, is I'm going to be... Uh, I'll unbox it for you guys because I want to unbox it for video proof if it, it arrives broken from Amazon or not. I thought that was a cop car went by. It's not. I don't like these. Uh, that's the engine that's originally out of it. As you can tell by the paint scheme. Not originally out of it. We scrapped that engine a long time ago. The engine that was out of it. Okay, this is the engine that's going to be that's had in it. Ready? <clears throat> 16 and a half brakes and strat and no VH, which is overhead valve, single cylinder, vertical shaft that was sitting in there. And then what was in it was an 18 twin cylinder opposed. And then we had a 16 horsepower Vanguard in it. Now I'm going to be putting a 16 um, industrial commercial brakes and strat and twin in it. So and that's opposed as well. So. Wow, <laughs> this is a lot of work. This video has got to be about 10 minutes now. I'm not 100% sure. Right now, since I started a new video, it says 327 on it, so. That's what, I'm, that's what I mean, so. Anyways, that's what I've been doing. I'm gonna clean it up a little bit, and uh, I'll give you guys an update what's going on. I'm hoping that Aaron's gonna help me take this engine out Friday morning, if he's not busy. Today is, uh, oh, good question. Wednesday? Tuesday? It's one of them. But anyways, um, I think it's Wednesday. It feels like a Wednesday to me. But, uh, I don't pay attention to the dates anymore. Every day is the same anyways. So, um, I don't think this is going to work. It's totally different wiring setup. Well, it's do or die. We had the other one. We had that one turning over. It just wasn't producing spark. Changed three or four coils on it. It still wasn't sparking. Changed the plugs on it. Still wasn't sparking. So I don't know. So that's it for now because I don't want to get past 15 minutes. John VM13 signing off. Take care.